hello now we can solve some examples of present tense so here is a worksheet for you we can start the first question read the following sentences and state whether the verbs in bold are in present tense simple present present continuous or present perfect tense so below you have given five questions in that five questions some words are written in bold letters so those words you will have to determine whether they are in simple present present continuous or present perfect tense of the verb okay let's go first one the watchman is guarding the house so here the letters which are written in bold is guarding is guarding so is it ing is plus i verb plus ing form so that is present continuous the first one is present continuous second one mohan enjoys flying kites enjoys the verb given here is enjoys enjoys as you know it's simple present tense enjoys third one nisha has participated in the sports meet so here the verb given is has participated has plus past participle of the verb that is the format of present perfect tense Yes the third one is present perfect tense fourth one rohan expects good result this year so the verb given here is expects that is the simple present my mother is decorating the house for the festival here the verb is is decorating is plus verb plus ing so it is present continuous next one write the sentences using the subject given in bracket subject we have to change the first sentence they have watched animated movies earlier so the subject given here is they they is a plural subject they have watched so if you are using she instead of they since she is a singular subject we have to use has with it she has watched animated movies earlier second one the chief minister has finalized the contract the chief minister that is a singular subject and we are going to change it with ministers that is plural subject the chief minister has finalized and when we are using ministers it will become ministers have finalized the contract because ministers is a plural subject so we should use have finalized ministers have finalized the contract third one we have eaten lunch we we is a plural subject so have we have eaten lunch we are going to change we by he he has he has eaten lunch because he is a singular subject we have to use has eaten he has eaten lunch we have eaten lunch and he has eaten lunch next each sentence first one he dash wear proper uniform to school every day we have to use the simple present tense of the verb wear he wears because he is singular sres will be added to the verb he wears proper uniform to school every day second question water freeze at 0 degree celsius simple present so what is the simple present of freeze freeze or freezes since it is singular water is singular we should use freezes es form freezes third punjab produce wheat in bulk quantity we have to use the simple present tense of produce of course punjab is a singular verb singular word or singular subject we should use produces Punjab produces wheat in bulk quantity. Fourth one, Niti dash read a story book. Present continuous. Present continuous. What is the format? Is or are plus verb plus ing. Here the 
subject as a singular word we should use as as plus a read plus ing that is as reading niti is reading a story book next we have to use present perfect tense of the verb given in the bracket that is throw the little boy the little boy is a singular subject the little boy throw a pebble to the pond the little boy has thrown since the little boy is a singular subject we should use has thrown has plus past part they dash leave for mumbai tomorrow here the verb given here as leave we have to use the present continuous tense of leave they are leaving since they as a plural subject we should use are they are leaving for mumbai tomorrow here dash come the director of the play the director as a singular subject so we should use here comes here comes the director of the play naman dash swim in the pool present continuous naman as a singular subject so we can use is swimming naman is swimming in the pool read the following passage and fill in the blanks with appropriate form of verb given in brackets in solids the constituent particles dash be very closely packed constituent particles that is a plural subject so what is the present form of be yes are are very closely packed they cannot move move will be move only because that is plural subject they cannot move from one place to another but only vibrate when one end of the spoon is heated the particles at the end particles since it is a plural subject we should use absorb only heat energy and start vibrating these vibrating particles collide why collide because vibrating particles these vibrating particles is a plural subject so we should use collide these particles also start vibrating more rapidly this process continues so here we we are using continuous sres form because this process that is only single process it's a singular subject so this process continues until the last particle also starts vibrating rapidly the heat energy is transferred to the entire spoon and the object on the object is a singular subject so here it becomes becomes object becomes hot thank you so much for watching the video